M0FXB, welcome back to the channel. Worked all at Britain Square, something that occasionally you will be asked for when you contact a station on HF radio. So I'm listening to this station here and they're nice and busy and every station that contacts him he the, he is asking them for the worked all britain square so i thought i'd show you how to find yours i'll put this link in the description it's whatsmylocator.co.uk and all you do is put in your postcode here which i've done just here and then search and it gives you two 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 lots of information the wab square and mine is st36 or you could use your grid square and they can work it out from that. My mine is IO81MI. So I hope that helps you. If we just turn this up. Quite a few stations calling in there. Mike Zero, Foxtrot, X-Ray, Bravo. Uh, Mike Zero, it's Foxtrot X-Ray, X-Ray Bravo, like having your bones X-rayed. Mike Zero, Foxtrot X-Ray Bravo, Andreas, Grid Square, Sierra Tango 36, back to you. It's quite weak for me. I think he said five and five. Yeah, Roger, it's uh, f the signal report is five and four, five and four, and the grid reference, or the WAB square, is Sierra Tango 36. <laughs> Yeah, you're very, very weak to me now. I've got some uh, QRM, but um, I'll just say that the report is five and four, five and four, and my name is Andreas. QSL, QSA, Sierra Echo 07, all confirmed. There you go. Job done. 7373, thank you too. All the best. And I don't even know what power I'm running. I'll check. Yes, yeah, so I just check. If you hold down the F, and then you turn this knob here, you eventually get to RF power, and that was just 20 watts. I don't really like to do higher, very high power. I was probably using that on FT8, and even that would have been high. I'll just quickly show you another little trick I've got here. This little box here. We'll turn this radio into an airband receiver. Let me just show you the box. <coughs> I have made another video, but while it's connected, I'm going to quickly show you. It's called a HIZ box, or HIZ air box. You, you still really need to connect your airband antenna to, your, to, the, to this side of it. Yeah? 
and then we've got the let's get it right we've got the airband antenna coming in here at the front RF in hopefully you can see that there it is and then patch lead to your radio at the back don't drop it like I have and then all you do is because it's a down converter of 110 megahertz you just tune down to 28 go to AM tune down to 28 on mine for Bristol Airport actually no it's 23850 and if an airplane flies over you will hear it and I've been using it today uh, check out that little gadget I'll put a link in the description bye for now worked all Britain 73